Okay, so I just got this package in the mail and this is something that I've been waiting for for a couple of weeks now and something I've been really looking forward to getting. So, a few of you might already know that the PlayStation 3 was recently hacked and you can now run your homebrew and your backups from the console. So, I mean the original hack was called the PlayStation Jailbreak and all it was was like a USB dongle that you plugged into the console and when you started it the console would run an exploit and from there you could then play your, your, your homebrew and your, your backups and all that kind of stuff. Uh, but what I've got here is basically going to be like the homebrew version of that, that device. It's a brand new device that's just come onto the market and I'll open up and show you. So I got this from a company called modtraders.co.uk and actually really really impressed with the, the service they've provided um, since the release of the hack. Uh, getting hold of the hardware you need to run the exploit for the, the PlayStation 3 has been really, really, really difficult because there's just been such a high demand for it. And originally what I did was I ordered a, a Teensy development board and yeah, they actually ran out of stock of those and what they were nice enough to do was upgrade my order to a Minimus AVR and this is basically a development board so I'll just pop this open. So basically it's a, a USB development board and what that will allow, allow me to do is install my own software onto the Wii chip on there and what I'll do is I'll install I think it's called PS Groove which is basically like the, the homebrew version of the original PlayStation jailbreak hack and once it's installed in there you plug it into your, your PlayStation 3 and when you start up the console, you, it will run the, the exploit and you'll be able to run Homebrew and your backups on your PlayStation 3, which is pretty cool. And you can use this for other other um, projects as well. It is really, basically it's just a, a USB development board, so you can put other software on there. You can see all the, the points along the... Oh, well, you can see that. You've got all the different... Um, contact points there, you can wire up different things and whatnot. But I would just be using this for running the, the PlayStation uh, jailbreak hack or PS Groove, the homebrew version of it. And you've got the two buttons on the top here, the two V, I don't know where you can see that, but there's two buttons. You've got two LEDs here and yeah, it's actually a really good quality device. It looks really nice. So what I'll do now is I'll install the software on this and I'll give it a shot in my PlayStation 3. Okay, so I've now got the PS Groove software installed on my Minimus development board here. Really, really easy to do. Just plugged it into my, uh, my laptop and flashed it using the software. And it took a couple of seconds. So now what I'll do is I'll plug it into the, the PlayStation 3 here. I'm going to give you a quick demonstration. So plug that in there. This thing above it is just the wireless dongle for my uh, my controller, so uh, just ignore that. But we'll switch it on from the back, like that. And to activate the dongle, what you're going to do is hit the power and then the, the eject button really, really quickly. So we'll do that now. And if it's worked, the red and green LEDs on the Minimus should come on, like that. The red light should go out when it's uh, activated and that's it done so what I'll do now is just sync up my controller and I'll sign in just give me a second so first thing you should notice is uh, you'll get a couple of extra options on your your uh, PlayStation menu here and you'll see that I've already installed the backup manager there and if I go up, you've also got an option to install package files. And you've got another option there as well. So from this, you can uh, you can install your your homebrew, and uh, you can run things like your backup manager here. And what that will allow you to do is uh, copy your games from the the Blu-ray drive here. You can copy them onto an external hard drive, or you can copy them onto the the hard drive in the PlayStation Three and uh, play your games from either of these locations, which is good. You can also uh, install your, your homebrew 
into these places as well. So you don't actually need the, the Minimus plugged in anymore because the uh, the exploit is now loaded. You will need it again the next time you start up your, your PlayStation 3, but uh, until then you can just plug in, you can plug in like your your USB drive or, or whatever else you need. So yeah, I just wanted to give you a quick overview of the, the Minimus uh, development board there running a PlayStation Groove. So thanks for watching and I'll catch you again soon.